What's up guys, my name is Volatile, welcome back to a brand new video on my channel and I hope you guys are having an amazing day as always. Anyways guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to get yourself a limited amount of money in Red Dead Redemption 2 online. So if you do want to find the glitch useful then do drop a huge thumbs up on this video and subscribe to my channel because I'm going to be uploading daily Red Dead Redemption 2 online content. I'm also running a giveaway right now and if you want to be entered into that giveaway then do follow the steps that appear on the screen right now which is to subscribe to my channel, like this video and thirdly comment why you want to win or why you deserve it and finally just hit the bell notification and the quicker you are to my videos the more I will notice you guys and that meaning if you are from the notification squad. This giveaway will be on 55 gold bars for 5 winners when I hit 10,000 subscribers so if you would like to win yourself gold bars on Red Dead Online then just follow the simple 4 steps. Anyways guys in today's video you will see how to make yourself a limited amount of money in Red Dead Redemption 2 online and this money making glitch is the same as the other one that I had shown in my video before with the fishing spot but in this video I'm going to show you a location that is much better and much quieter so that no one else knows about this unless after this video is released then maybe more people will go to it but right now no one knows about it so if you guys want to go to that location and get yourself money then you can just go and follow this video and this spot is actually good as well because every time you head off to Blackwater there is always someone at the fishing spot so it's quite hard to get easy money uh, other than doing other Red Dead Online glitches or a lot of showdown grinding but nonetheless guys what you need to do in this glitch is just go to the Awenja River, I think I said that right, Awenjila, Awenjila River, because this spot requires the same stuff from other fishing location where you bait the fish onto the land with an animal and this spot is just as good as Blackwater because it is very close to the butcher in Strawberry where you can quickly just trade in your fish for cash and any other animal parts or skin that you may have got on the way of the glitch. So before you actually go to the location just make sure you have an animal on the back of your horse that can be skinned and when you're within the range of the location you might not find many deers because as I was looking for deers in the video I was near the glitch location and I could not find any so what I did was I just hunted down a fox that I could find which is very easy to find in the location so if you can find an animal that can be skinned just take that animal and hunt it down and then once you've done that you can just place on the back of your horse so make sure the animal that is on the back of your horse is not skinned as well because if the animal is skinned then the fish won't be uh, the fish won't be attracted to it the animal does not matter if it's a one star or a two star or a three star pelt because at the end of the glitch if you want extra money you can skin that animal and sell the animal items and the skin as well and the fish does not get attracted to any specific type of rate uh, rating star pelt so you can just go ahead and pick up any type of animal that you want. But anyways guys, once you have reached to the location, what you'll need to do is just get off your horse and pick up the animal that you have hunted down. And from here, just walk over to this spot where I am right as you can see. And just drop the animal somewhere where it is on land but also not too much on land. Because it still needs to be in the water a bit. And that is so that the fish does come over to the bait and as soon as it hits the land, boom, the fish will die instantly and you can just go ahead and pick up the fish at a 3 star rating right after that. But right now I did mess up because I was just testing the spot, I was just testing the animal for the best spot to place so in this video I'm going to show you which are the best spots where you can bait the most fishes and you can get the fastest fishes as well. So right now as you can see I'm showing you the, one of the best spots to place your animals so you can just go ahead and copy me like I have right now and from here once you have placed the animal just wait for the fish to get baited in and whilst you're waiting you should also keep an eye out for the fish that are dying so that they don't disappear back into the water. This method is a lazy AFK type of glitch because you aren't really required to grind for money you can just go ahead and wait for the fish to appear onto the land and die. 
which is a very good method for you guys if you're feeling very lazy. So far from this part, four fish has already died and some were not dead because they were still in the water so keep moving the animal around till you find the best suitable location for you. And one thing you should know about this glitch is that you will gain positive honor whenever you pick up the fish for being resourceful so this glitch can be quite useful in many ways as well. Also you see me picking up three fishes right now instead of four because I said four fishes but afterwards I did see that there was a fourth fish that I did not pick up so also use your dead eye and if you don't have any dead eye then you just use the L3 and R3 analog stick just click them together if you that's if you're on the PS4 I'm not sure on the Xbox but once you click them together you go into the slow mo hunting mode and once you have done that uh, you can just find the fishes that have the fish that has died every now and then just keep moving your animal around as well because that way more fish will spawn and get attracted to your animal and right here in this part of the video I caught one of the biggest fish which is the musky and these are worth quite a lot of money from the butcher so if you do catch yourself one of these big fish then you can just go ahead and pick it up and place it on the back of your horse and make sure that your horse does not disappear because if they do disappear then you've just lost out on so much cash that you could have gained from the butcher so always keep an eye out on the horse as well so that they don't go anywhere or get scared off you can do this glitch as many times as you want but whenever you do it for too long the fish may not be attracted anymore to the animal so to go around this uh, fix or bug or whatever what you'll need to do is just skin your animal and go ahead and sell your animals and fish so, which is what I did at this point to the butcher and once you have reached the butcher and sold all the fish and animal parts that you have gained from the glitch you can return back to the location with another animal to continuously bait more fish onto the land and make yourself way more money than you would in a showdown series. This glitch is by far one of the best for money making currently on Red Dead Online as you can see because once I've reached back to the butcher in Strawberry you will see how much money you can make in about 10 minutes time of doing the glitch. So after I have sold all of my other animal skins and parts to the butcher I was left with $601 and as you can see whilst I'm selling all my fish that I have gained in 10 minutes of doing the glitch at the end of it I was left with $623 and this means that I have gained $22 profit in just 10 minutes and like I always say if you spend 10 minutes in a showdown series you only finish one match and the max you'd get in that match is about 10 to 16 dollars which is nothing compared to this method that you're doing right now and you are also saving bullets because in a showdown you'll be, you'll be shooting so much bullets that you keep having to restock on your ammunition however in this glitch you are not required to shoot any fishes or anything like that all you have to do is just hunt down an animal and that is it also you can do this glitch whilst watching a Netflix show or a movie or any YouTube video so that you can time pass and gain money at the same time. Anyways guys that is it for today's video if you guys did find it useful then drop a like and do subscribe to my channel because I'm going to be uploading daily Red Dead Online content for you guys and if you do want to enter the giveaway still then just follow the rules that will appear on the screen right now which is the 4 easy steps subscribe to my channel like like this video right now comment down why you want to win or why you deserve to win the giveaway and fourth and finally the last one is just to hit the bell notification so that you guys can be quick to my videos and I will notice who is here first on my video anyways guys if you do have any questions left for this glitch then do drop it down in the comments below because either me or someone else will try my best or try their best whoever is helping you out to help you out as much as possible and so if you do have any questions then do drop them down in the comments below because I will try my best to help every single one of you and I'm also replying to every single comment on this video right now so go ahead and drop a comment like and tell me what you guys think about it if you have any requests or if you have any suggestions or something that I should fix up on then just tell me down in the comments below because I will love that comment and then I will also reply to it with a thank you so don't 
so feel free to drop any comment that you guys want to help me out in, to improve my videos more also guys i've seen quite a lot of people commenting down in the comments below saying that i'm stealing content when all of my content is actually my own and i've uh, and as you can see in the gameplays the gamer tag is my gamer tag on the ps4 which is x silent sag x as you can see in most of my videos well nearly all of my videos if i press down on the d-pad and I'm not stealing any content because I also have my logo on the video at the bottom right hand side as well. This is just a, a little disclaimer for you guys so that you can stop commenting that I've been stealing videos. That is all for today's video guys. I hope you did find it useful as I would say and if you did then just you know drop a like. My name is Volatile and I'm out. Goodbye.